Unearth the meaning, understanding, fracking. Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today, we have a very interesting topic on our hands that is not only relevant to language learning but also connects to broader issues in our world today. We are going to delve into the term, fracking. This word might sound a bit technical at first, but don't worry, we'll break it down together. And by the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of what it means and how it's used. So, let's get started. Fracking is actually short for hydraulic fracturing. This is a process used to extract oil and natural gas from deep underground. In simpler terms, it involves drilling down into the earth and then directing a high-pressure water mixture at the rock to release the gas or oil inside. The mixture used in this process typically contains water, sand, and chemicals. Fracking has become a hot topic in recent years due to its environmental and health implications. On one hand, it has helped to boost oil production and driven down gas prices. On the other hand, there are concerns about its potential to cause earthquakes, contaminate drinking water, and impact public health. This dual nature makes it a controversial subject and a word that often pops up in news and discussions around energy and the environment. Now that you understand what fracking is and why it's significant, let's look at how to use it in a sentence. The town held a meeting to discuss the potential effects of fracking on their local water supply. Many environmental activists are opposing fracking due to its potential to harm the ecosystem. As you can see from these examples, fracking is often used in contexts related to environmental concerns and energy production. And that brings us to the end of our exploration into the term, fracking. We hope that this video has helped demystify this term for you and has provided some valuable context on why it's such a prominent topic in today's discussions around energy and the environment. Remember, learning a language is not just about memorizing words and grammar, it's also about understanding the cultural and social context in which certain terms are used. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, happy learning.